Okay, flea market finds. The Labor Day weekend, 2014. Uh, August 30th, I believe it is. Yeah, August 30th, 2014. Did four flea markets today. Sorry, yeah, three flea markets and one antique store. We have ammo cans. Three 50 cals, one 20 millimeter box. We have a portable Victrola for parts. We have a Japanese Arasaka bayonet for parts. We have a brand new Ara, uh, outer's cleaning kit from the 1960s. It's in perfect shape, pretty much. Album of 70 RPM records, we got more in there. We have a Japanese Arisaka Type 99. Early issue, it has the chrome line bore, missing the cleaning rod, but it is matching number, and it is ground. The chrysanthemum is ground off it, but the condition and the price I paid for this makes it well worthwhile. I will have to scrub off some paint splatters, but nothing all that serious. And this is an Italian made 50 caliber Hawken hunting rifle. Brand new, this has never been fired. It's probably 20 years old, but it's never been fired. High quality. Cabela's gets what for these these days? 500 bucks? This was under $100. Never been shot. And this is a 4570. Actually, I better check that. That might actually be 5070. That's 5070, I bet. Rolling block Remington carbine. Need a little bit of woodwork to it. Not in bad shape. Did a bundle deal on this. Got a good deal on it. You can see it's got some cracks in the wrist. But otherwise, not bad at all. Still has the uh, Remington address and everything on there. Remington rolling block. I need a little cleaning up. And as you can see, the saddle ring is there. It is a real carbine, not cut down from a rifle. Very hard to find these days. So it was a productive day. Oh, almost forgot, almost forgot. Tucked away behind everything. We have a 36 caliber brasser. There you go. I don't think this has been fired either, to tell you the truth. Nice condition, nice patina starting to form on there. Probably Pedersoli, but I gotta look into that. Maybe not. Round barrel, the Reb style. What does it say on there? Navy Arms. Oh shit, that's actually a Navy Arms. Okay. That's nice. That means a little older than I thought, but perfectly okay. As it would happen, I bought this off a vendor at a flea market, and I stopped in at a big antique store some distance away to find out that he was the one who owned it. I said, where's the owner today? To the guy behind the counter. Well, he's at a flea market. Where? Elephant's truck. What do you know? I was just there over in Connecticut. And I just bought the guy because he told me he had one of these in the shop. And I said, well, where is it? I want to see it. I said, well, you know what? Don't look anymore. I just bought it from your boss. And I bought the rifle from him too, the Arasaka. And he gave me a nice holster with it. And I also bought a large Victrola of the Ninth Big, I have that somewhere else, a big, uh, big Victrola that's going to be restored by me when I get around to it, serviced and taken care of. And this parts machine here will provide numerous parts for other machines I'm working on. All in all, it was a, the weather was, as you can see, kind of gray and threatening and thunderstorms are supposed to happen, probably will later. But uh, a lot of vendors stayed away because of that. They were afraid of the storm. But there were just enough there that I had a productive day for a change. I rarely find firearms at flea markets anymore. So this, this was uh, of any kind, even black powder. So this was a surprisingly productive day for me. For firearms and ammo cans. You know what? Ammo cans get a little scarce. Especially around here. And I got good deals on every one of them. So I was very happy with that because 50s, I haven't had any of them come near me in a while. Wish I could have found some fat 50s, but I'll take the regular 50s. They have their uses too. And that flat 20 millimeter, that's going to be useful for something. In fact, I picked this 36 if it right in there. And the records were always useful too. So there you go. That's the flea market finds for today. Uh, shit, how do I turn this off?